Hello, Jay here, welcome to eonsbattle.com, and today we're going to be making an acid pool base. First thing I did was I took some fine grit sandpaper and I sanded off the texturing that these 40k bases come with. I then took a little hot melt glue and some cork and began making the the, um, the piece of rock that the model is going to be standing on. Make sure it's large enough. I would take the model beforehand and make sure you know where its feet are going to be so that you can position the rock so that it'll be easy to place the model on. I then took some smaller pieces of, of cork to make smaller rocks floating in the acid. And then took the, my the tip of my knife and I used that to scrape out some of the pieces of cork to make it look a little bit un more uneven and more natural. And then primed the model black. First thing I did to the rocks was I dry brushed a dark gray. Made it a pretty even dry brushing. And I moved on to a much lighter gray. I then began working on the lava pool by base coating the remainder of the exposed base in yellow. This will probably take several coats. Once that was done, I began painting on a light green onto the yellow. I tried to make it a little bit patchy and uneven so that it looked like the acid was, was uh, moving. Then moved on to a darker green right over the yellow. Yellow helps make almost like a glowing effect from underneath. Make sure that you take special care to hit the edge of the base to make sure that there's no yellow line exposed. And then dry brush the green onto the rock to make it look like it was glowing. If you have any other techniques or ideas you'd like to see us do, please leave in the comments below. If you'd like to see more of our videos, you can see them at eonsbattle.com. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. Thanks for watching.